billion. How would they ask a minister? So how much is uh, the um, uh, coastal road? And then you're dancing around, you know, going to say, no, the next kilometer is different from next kilometer. Yeah, what is the average cost? <laughs> when we did uh, or you to, he said it was about 9.9, .9, almost 10 billion. I said, but this time around 34 or 35 kilometers. Average cost 238 million per kilometer. When we did or your no, it's saying to Obama shop, 76 kilometers it was about 43 billion. Average cost almost 500 and something, maybe 500 million uh, per kilometer. And we have two bridges, one over Ogun River and then one at Obama shop end. Uh, 70 billion, and they probably you have done maybe 50 kilometers then that is when you divide and say you have an average cost. Average cost is definitive. Then estimated cost is a, a probable uh, uh, element. And so, uh, 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 and uh, when I heard, uh, you know, somebody uh, showed me what my brother and friend, you know, uh, Governor Mark in there of your state said, uh, I don't want to join issues with him, but I think he's uh, an engineer, I think he's an electrician. Oh, sorry, uh, they call it elect, elect, you know, elect, elect. Mm. Uh, this uh, road construction, <laughs> elect, elect, no rich day. I'm a senior in governance and I'm a senior in engineering practice. And so anything he doesn't understand, he should call me and ask. And I will not join the issue because I have respect for our governors. I have respect for him as my friend and brother. But he should withdraw the word that I'm dancing around. I never dance around. And uh, if he insists, he should come for debate. That is very important. It should come for debate and then we can have uh, this thing. You know. So there is no ambiguity in cost per kilometer, but I'm teaching them that cost per kilometer could be divided into estimated cost, which has elements of variance, and then average cost, which is definitive. That is what uh, it is. <laughs> ah, good. Did you listen to that? That's Dave May, the Minister of Works. Can you imagine? Now you came, you explained as if you are the only engineer in the house. As if you are the only engineer in the house. As if you know better than others. Practi professor in practice. <laughs> professor in practice. Professor without certificate. Can you imagine? Now you came, you just... Ah, God, this country is a joke. APC minister, some of them, they are just a joke. They are, they are taking this country for a joke. You came. For what a, a, a governor of or your state said, Mackinley. So you want him to withdraw his statement for saying you are dancing around the uh, dancing around the question. Now you okay, you did not tell us the cost per kilometer. You didn't tell us the average cost. You are saying dribbling around. I see the question does not have answer. There is answer to the question. Go on, answer the question. But you won't do that. You are asking the governor to withdraw his statement. Will you choo -choo not get respect? Yes, we will not get respect for PDP. Now don't destabilize, destroy PDP. That's why you will come like asking a sitting governor or opposition who criticize you, criticize party opposition party. You're asking him to withdraw his statement for what? He did fear you. No, think about it now. What you did was wrong, yet you did not come with evidence, the answer, after, before asking him to, to withdraw his statement. So now you want Shea Makinde to truly come and say, I withdraw my statement for saying Dave May was dancing around the question, for not answering the question. No, now you you you, you the joke. That's a joke. That's a joke. So if opposition criticize your government, you should withdraw the statement. What do you take him for? Or what do you take PDP for? Not This one is not even, uh, this is not Hussein in Arufai. This is not me. You're asking the sitting governor opposition to withdraw his statement for criticizing you for failure to answer the question. And Shei Makin, they have explained to you that when he is a governor, he, he, he awarded a, a contract project like this. He said, this is you. He, he, he gave you the breakdowns of the project he did. This is the cost. This is the cost. 
He said, how would you say you don't have answer? You are dancing and I yet you did not come now to prove him wrong to say this is equal. You are still dribbling, dancing around. So now she marking they will not come. Say, uh, I want to withdraw my statement for for saying that uh, David May was dancing around the question. The say uh, uh, David May was right for not answering the question. Uh, uh, David May was right. There is no there is nothing like cost per kilometer. Uh, there is nothing like average cost. Uh, David May was right. You can you cannot get the the average cost because it's di it's different from one kilometer one to kilometer two. Uh, because there are some drainages on this kilometer on the other one there are no drainages. It's not possible to get cost per kilometer kilometer that's rubbish so yeah uh, now i withdraw my statement i didn't say that again uh, she uh, david may was right what nonsense that's nonsense that's insult in the faces of pdp members asking the city governor if you you no now now don't see pdp finish how can opposition criticize the government because this is this that they they, 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 are, they, they they know say they are guilty do you know why David Mehi has refused to provide answer to this question caused by kilometer because if he has done that it will enable all Nigerians to calculate and get the answer with the, the money we are expected Nigeria expected uh, uh, in constructing that road because if he has done that we use that to calculate all the kilometer 700 kilometer be we use that to calculate we we'll get the answer because now a lot of engineers we have a lot of engineers in the house in the building a lot of engineers say it's not big you are just opportune opportunity to be tinobu's minister of works it's not as if you are the most qualified you are the you are the most competent engineer no it's just opportunity for you that be a minister of works does not mean that you know better than others a lot of engineers have said that project is a scam that the money was the money budgeted for that project is too much truly we are talking about trillion an engineer in the house, I, I, I listen to a lot of engineers who says that project is billion. It's not for what you know, billion, you know, trillion that that it shouldn't be more than how many billion, a, a, a 20 billion or something. Uh, do you know how many trillion? I mean, do you know how many billions you, tri you're talking about? Trillion that's a scam because he does not have an answer to the question. That's why he's asking if, if, if I'm the one who made that statement, you're asking me to withdraw the statement, I will not even withdraw the statement. A law a sitting governor or PDP opposition, he should withdraw the statement for you for your failure. For ah, uh, no, now don't see PDP finish. You no, now don't see PDP finish. Jo Oga, join issue with issue. He said, You're not ready to join issue with issue. Join issue with Shay Makide. At that time, they will be able to expose you the more. Then, engineer in the house, we come in, we come in and prove you wrong. That it is possible to answer the question it is possible to give a breakdown give a cost breakdown cost per kilometer average cost if you do that they will prove you wrong okay not try out not try out and i from day one this project has been a problem because they do not follow due process there was no bidding for uh, for this project they just come you told us that's the reason why it's difficult for them because there's no bidding for it it does not pass through the normal process no, you just came and you, you told us that we are, going to, we are going to do this project and it's going to cost this amount. No, nobody has right to answer question again. Just like uh, first okay, I'm okay. Nothing, nothing. He just said they are going to re 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 renovate this airport and it's going to cost 700 or something billionaire. Just like that. Case closed. No questioning. Rubbish. Hey, stop that. Saying a city governor should withdraw his statement. No, he's not going to do that. Anyways, what do you think? Do you think it is right for Shay Makinde, a sitting governor, PDP governor, to withdraw a statement saying that David May was dancing around the question? He failed to answer the question. What do you think? Do you think he should withdraw the statement or he should even add more fire? Leave your comment and don't forget to share this video.